Well, today is a very exciting day. I'm going to attempt to start my engine in the next couple of minutes. I've just been around and topped up the carburetors with my tank. I've got a little um, plastic tank here. So I've connected up to the inlet ports here on both the carburetor banks, topped them up to the top. I've actually squirted a tiny bit of fuel down each back of here just to sort of help it go. And that's sort of percolating through at the moment as we speak. I've got my three sets of standard Z1 um, points ignition coils there with my KH250 Boyer ignition system here. I've got a battery which isn't got enough charge in it to actually crank the engine, so I'm going to use my Kickstarter. So I'll connect that up to there in a second. But she's basically all together. I've got no headers on it, so it's going to probably sound a bit spitty, but we'll see. I'm hoping it's going to go. So I have kicked it over a couple of times just to sort of get the hang of it. I have to stand on the table to do it, so it's a bit precarious, but well, um, well, I think this, this is it now. I'm a little bit nervous actually, but let's go for it. Right, well, here we go. So just start the engine. I'm gonna have to get up on the bench like this, come across here onto there, hold onto the engine. I'm gonna give it a good sharp jab down and see what happens. <laughs> oh, that's promising, she fired. Didn't put the choke on. I'm really pleased that my Z1 Super 6 engine is running. 1400cc six cylinder it is silky smooth. I can't believe how smooth it is. I was actually expecting a little bit of buzzy vibration considering it's just resting on my wooden table in my garage. But it's nothing. It's absolutely nothing. When you rev it, it doesn't feel like it's running except your, your ears are telling that it is running. So it'd be interesting to see how it goes when it's in the bike. But I've got no oil leaks. I've had a good look around it really closely and I've got no oil leaks at all, which is a good sign. I have actually removed the cam covers. It's full of oil, so I know there's oil going around okay. But, um, and the carbs are all synchronized nicely. It seems to idle very nicely, and it certainly revs. We can't really tell with no exhaust and no airbox what it's running like, because you need the exhaust system and the airbox on these bikes to um, make them run properly. But considering that, it runs really well. So on to the next stage now, which is basically restoring the bike. I've got the whole bike, so... Um, just a standard restoration, so it's relatively straightforward and easy to do. So um, watch this space. <laughs> 